Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Easily crop photos in Lightroom Classic CC. To crop a photo, display the photo in the Develop module. Then click to select the Crop Overlay tool in the tool strip within the right panel group. The tool strip expands to display the crop tools in the tool drawer and the mouse pointer changes into the Crop Frame Pointer tool when held over the image. An outline with adjustment handles also displays over the photo in the image display area. You can press the O key on your keyboard to cycle through different types of grids. You can adjust the grid display to suit your needs. If you want to display the grid only when you're cropping a photo, select Tools, Tool Overlay, Auto Show from the menu bar. You can also turn off the grid display entirely by selecting Tools, Tool Overlay, Never Show from the menu bar instead. To crop the image, click and drag in the image display area with the Crop Frame Pointer to set the crop boundary. Alternatively, you can use the corner and side adjustment handles in the image display area to define the crop boundary. Once you set the cropping boundary, you'll notice that the part of the photo outside of the boundary is darkened and the grid outline is only overlaid on the part of the photo within the boundary. You can reposition the photo within the crop boundary. To do this, click and drag within the crop frame using the hand tool. To adjust the angle of the image during the crop operation, you can use the angle slider that appears in the tool drawer. You'll also notice a constraint to image checkbox in the tool drawer. If you check this checkbox, the crop bounding box remains within the image area when the lens corrections are applied. This prevents the photo from becoming distorted as adjustments are made. To reset the crop boundary, click the Reset button. When you have the crop looking the way that you want, you can simply click the Crop Overlay tool in the tool strip to execute the crop operation. Lightroom Classic CC also lets you crop photos to a specific aspect ratio. To do this, select the Crop Overlay tool in the tool strip. The padlock icon in the tool drawer controls and shows whether crop controls are constrained. You can click the padlock to toggle between constrained and unconstrained states. You can select an aspect ratio from the aspect pop-up menu that appears in the tool drawer. To preserve the photo's original aspect ratio, choose original from the menu. To enter a specific aspect ratio not shown within the menu, you can select custom. You can save up to five custom crop ratios in Lightroom Classic CC. If you create more than five, the older custom ratios are removed from the menu. After selecting an aspect ratio from the aspect drop-down menu, you can drag a crop handle or drag with the crop frame tool to set the crop outline. If you want to temporarily constrain the photo's current aspect ratio, you can hold down the shift button on your keyboard as you drag. After defining the crop boundary, you can use the hand tool to drag the photo within the boundary. When you're finished making your adjustments, Click the Crop Overlay tool in the tool strip to execute the crop. Also notice that you can switch the crop orientation during a crop operation. To do this, first select the Crop Overlay tool in the tool strip and set the crop boundary as you normally would. Then simply press the X key on your keyboard to change the orientation of the crop from landscape to portrait or from portrait to landscape. The crop frame switches orientation while maintaining its aspect ratio. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.